My name is Timothy Jordan. And my name is Jaleesa Harris. Well, this is my girlfriend. Um, we've known each other since we were children at Oakwood Elementary School. But she was a grade below me. And the reason we did build such a friendship was because we were we joined after school care. So we like saw each other all the time in after school care. But Going on to West Hall Middle, West Hall High, we never really spoke to each other. I mean, we noticed each other and say hi or whatever, but never really had that friendship. And um, we went our separate ways to college, and then after college, we kind of, I don't know, we noticed each other again. And she was working at a coffee shop, and I came by. There was a little church going on there that I was attending, and um, she said she noticed me, and I noticed her, and we got contact on Facebook and started talking and soon I asked her out on a date. And I said no. <laughs> <laughs> a couple of times. But we finally got together and we've been dating for almost a year and a half now. Well, I was raised up in church. Um, I believe I was saved at the age of eight during a revival that was going on at our church. Um, I just felt the Holy Spirit come upon me, laid out in the Spirit, and I knew even as a child things that I, were doing, I was doing was wrong. So I just like gave my life over to Christ and said, I'm gonna live for you from now on. Um, I was in children's church too. I was 10 years old and with my cousin and we were like, I was like, we should do it. Let's go to the front. Let's do it. Let's give it. She's like, okay. So we went to the front and we gave her life to Christ. I work at a dental laboratory, Pittman Dental to be exact. And um, I work in front of a computer. So we get cases in and I kind of scan the teeth and design the crowns that will soon be made to the patient. And I also work for a dental laboratory, but I work for Gibson Dental Laboratory. I do the billing, and I also have to talk to the doctors, so I do the other end when the teeth come in and when the teeth come out, they go through me. I'm very passionate about art. Um, I went to school at the Art Institute of Atlanta. I have been all my life. I've loved to draw, um, color, create. And um, I really noticed in my senior year of high school that it was what I wanted to do for a living. Um, and I, my main focus was on animation and cartoons. I always wanted to dig into like how it's actually made, how it's done, how do you just bring these characters to life. And um, that's what I went to school at Art Institute for, was media arts, animation. Well, I graduated from high school. I was smart, I'll give myself that, but I didn't know exactly what I wanted to do. So I went into college my first two years undecided, and then I got into chemistry and biology, and I loved it and excelled at it. So I, I really love science. I'm crafty, not as crafty as him, but I'm crafty. But I love biology, and I love being in the lab, not the dental laboratory, actual laboratory, doing tests. Um, I also like to write and uh, work on music. I was involved in a rap group actually for the past four years and um, we recently kind of split, have separate ministry ideas and things there, but I'm definitely also continuing in that, still writing, making music, so that's another passion. I also like extreme sports, skateboarding, snowboarding, love to watch it on TV, Winter X is happening right now, I'm so psyched about that. Um, I, I sing, but I'm too nervous. I'm also a musical theater geek, and I, I'm very proud of it. <laughs> no, I love dancing, too, and I love children. I think because they're about my height, but I love children, too, and just to have fun. And I come off as kind of solemn at first, but I'm really, I'm really crazy. So, it's something people don't know about me. <laughs> what was your face going to say? <laughs> Roller skating. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we were searching for a church family um, who just experienced real people, real worship, a real church, and that's what we found here. Surprise, surprisingly enough, that's the slogan, and um, we loved it coming here. We were planning on visiting other churches but hadn't been able to leave here. We love it so much. 
Um, so we knew that you know we had to get on board and, and become a covenant partner and, and help out any way we can and uh, we've taken all the steps and just can't wait to see what God has in store for us and has in store for this church and we are blessed to be a part.